Shout to Tajiks. These are melting pots that melt the lead in. These are the do it molds. Uh, this is a crappie mold. There's collared and uncollared jigs. The collared use just the thread. You normally use Chanel or something. But the uncollared, uh, the uncollared typically uses less material. This is a whip finisher that uh, completes the knot on the jig. This has different applications for tying flies for trout fishing, but I use it mainly to just put the glue on the jig to uh, finish it out, keep the knot tight. Have your thread, have your powder paint. Uh, most of the jigs that I pour use powder paint. It's simple, makes a durable finish, uh, especially after you bake it in the oven for about 20 minutes. These are snippers to just snip off the extra lead after you pour it. This is the vise. It's not a very expensive vise, but it gets the job done. We're going to start off with a collar jig. You just put it in the vise like that, tighten it up pretty firmly. Start the string right next to the head and you overlap it to lock it in place. Cut the excess off. Got some marabou. And the collar jig you know, typically uses more feather, marabou, whatever you're using. Slide it up there to get your hook and the collar centered on the marabou. Try to get your thread all where it's lined up. I turn it around and make sure that I got good coverage all the way around. Collar jigs typically have a smaller profile, which uh, most crappie fishermen like when the bite's tougher you want a smaller profile jig take my whip finisher do it like such, make a loop make another loop trim the excess or cut it. Get your cement. Yes. Put some on your thread, and that will protect your knot. Now this jig doesn't have eyes on it, but if you want eyes, if you feel like you have to have eyes, that's easy to make. You just take a small nail or a small piece of wood, put it in white paint, come up, dot it. On each side, you have eyes. That's all there is. Now you can corner the profile you want. You can leave it like that. 
you can pull it down, trim it, there it is. Now go fish Tennessee.